allowed to tell everybody what you're doing? Today we are bringing home our pony. What type My of pony? pony? She is our food Ooh, So we had her, didn't we? Yes, we did. What's she called? Mookie. Mookie. Hello. Hello. We've got the trailer on, haven't we? We have. Pony. Mookie. Please comment below. What do you think of the name Mookie? <laughs> I can't quite decide. For now. Because it could be Spooky Mookie. We've got her in the stable. And Lily's just going to change head collar so she's got a little bit more control of her. I'm just teaching her a bit of groundwork now before we put her in the, the horse trailer. She's a lovely little girl, isn't she? I quite she's, like the name. She's fretting to rear when she's shaking. Well, she, yeah, like she's, mm -hmm. she doesn't know right. yet. Mookie. Good girl, Mookie. The head. So we're just going to swap to a natural horsemanship head collar, which is easier for the horse to understand pressure and release with. Actually, we could keep that head collar for when she grazes. Her little thing is rearing to get out of trouble, isn't it? Mm -hmm. She's a lot of decent size, and she's scared of things. Not because she's been hurt, just because it's completely new to her. Mm. She's doing very, very well for a totally raw horse, as they call them here in Hungary. She's a very quick horse. Mm -hmm. Now we're just going to take her to the trailer in a minute after we've done a bit more. And on the trailer she'll probably go in two or three times before we ask her to stay in. I've just done the sense size of the head collar, so she's not... She's learned to trust me a bit more and not be scared of her, I think. And now I'm just getting her used to me, so she's not scared of me. I can't take her anymore, she's upset with me, can I? No. She's a bit touchy about her bumps. Yeah, it's her kidneys. As soon as you get to the kidney area, she starts saying, oh, that's far enough, thanks. So we're just getting a little bit of safety control for loading mm -hmm. and trust and a bit of a relationship before we try and take her into a trailer because she's never been in a trailer before. She's not really been handled before, she's in a car. No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. To come out and see how she behaves with the yapping dog. I honestly would use the longer <coughs> rope. Yeah, just that one's very swift. Isn't it? I don't know. I think <coughs> Not really, for when you go in the trailer, because you want to stay behind and let her drive in and let her turn around and come back out, and that rope's not going to give you that extra length to do that with. Honestly, though, just try it. Put this one on.
Just walk confidently as if she's always done it. Yes, good girl. It's all fine, don't worry. You don't want to itch there, you silly horse. <laughs> that dog is so annoying. If only the man could catch it and put it away. She's actually licking me. She needs salt if she's licking you, sweetie. Third foot on. What have we got in our trailer? Um, a pig. Yeah, okay. yeah, we decided to skip the pony idea and buy one of his pigs. So we got a pony in the trailer. We got a pony. First time she's ever loaded. Took a bit of time to do. Yeah, it was about two hours, just slowly, slowly. So we're driving home carefully now. Driving nicely. With our precious cargo. Need a new name for her. The only idea I have is Ed Edna. Which I is... think I prefer Mo 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 Yeah. Beautiful day here in Hamilton. Nice. Well, so our herd has increased by one. We've got uh, our second purebred, Hootsel. She came off a good breeder, but uh, the breeder died before the paper transaction was done or something. So um, she's Hootsel. That's all we need to know. Yeah. You can make some money and start buying and importing pedigree Hootsels from the Carpathian Mountains. We paid £700 for that. 750 I think. I don't know what ponies go for at the moment. She was worth paying the extra for because she wasn't damaged by anyone, she wasn't touched. She yeah. was wild and raw. Because it's easier to start a raw horse than one that's already been started and failed. Exactly. It just like takes them 10 minutes to learn everything, it's really good. If they've been messed around, it takes a heck of a lot longer. Mm -hmm. We've made it home. Kate is probably quite sweated up in there it's going to have been very hot and also it's quite a stressful thing to have done oh you're not too badly sweated up are you there's a good girl hello good girl good girl let's give her a few minutes to get used to the door being open and then go put her head collar on and bring her out 
Yeah, you're used to dogs, we know that much. <laughs> dogs, meet Mookie, Mookie, meet dogs. Will you believe me, darling? You need the long rope. And you need to go in through the groom's door. She's trying to rear up, so be careful. What she's going to need to do, Lil, is turn around and walk out with you holding right at the end of the rope. She won't back out. Good girl. Watch your fingers in all the clips. Good girl. Well, she doesn't try and push through the grooms at the door. They do do that. So she's clipped up to the fat head collar, the normal head collar for the um, trailer. And we've got her training head collar onto the long rope. She's going to turn around, Lil, and I'll catch the rope if she takes it from you as she turns around and comes out. Let's get the knots out of it quick. Here she comes. Ooh. Let go, let go, let go. Because she'll jump straight off. No, she won't. Good girl. Ooh. Got it? Just take her a walk down past the other horses. Take her mind off what's been going on now. She's so small, isn't she? Hmm. Right. Go on then, off you two go, see how she goes. Just you need to be a strong leader because she's going to want to take her strength from you now. She needs strong boundaries to feel safe like any child does. She's just learning not to walk past Lily. As we said, she needs to respect her leader. Exactly. Isn't she just? Beautiful mare, Mookie, but we're not going to keep her name Mookie, Lily says. So, suggestions in the comments if you can think of a really nice name while she joins our herd as Lily's project horse. She is a bit of a go-go girl. I think the best thing we can do with her now is take her for a nice walk just to relax all those muscles that she's got stiff and uncomfortable with, free them up after being in the trailer. Good girl. She's a very quick learner. Already learning where the bubble is. Hmm. 
See how what the others think. Here they come. It's Rodney in the lead, followed by Lucky and Del Boy. What is that? Are you going to be nice to her? Boys are quite excited about that, aren't you? Hey, I'm surprised Delboy's not more excited than me. Future wife material, yeah. yeah. You've got stallion bits. What do you think of her? Rodney's more stallion than Delboy. Maybe Rodney's saying, If I wasn't a girl, then this is how you need to behave, okay? <laughs> she says, I'm interested in that mare, she looks just like me. A lot of licking and chewing there from the foal, the black one, which is Del Boy. Just what a foal would do is saying, don't hurt me, I'm a foal. Lick, lick, chew, chew, chomp, chomp. Rodney is more being a show off and saying, look at me and I'm quite strong. Yeah, I remembered I'm a stallion. Oh, he said, look at that bowed neck. <laughs> She's happy now. So say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, share and give us a comment so we know you're there. Bye-bye.